Hi, welcome back to Mama Four Boys. Tonight I'm going to make Polska Kielbasa with uh, potatoes and onions and sauerkraut in the Ninja Speedy. So the first thing we're going to do, I've cubed up, peeled and cubed up four potatoes and one half of a white onion. And I'm going to uh, add in some olive oil and some spices to that uh, and mix it around. And I've preheated my Ninja Speedy and I'm going to put the, all that in there and let it cook on the uh, the bake mode for maybe 10 minutes before I put the kielbasa and the sauerkraut in to finish out the meal. It's very easy, quick and fast, and we'll be back. All right, we're back. The next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna put a, a decent amount of olive oil on our potatoes and onions. We like to use this Himalayan salt, pepper, and garlic uh, mixture. We're gonna add that in a little bit. We're gonna add in some paprika this is the sweet kind. It's not really, really hot and spicy. I'm gonna put in some uh, fresh ground black pepper just because I want the pepper, uh, chunks of pepper in there. All right. And then we're just gonna take, we're gonna mix that up like this. Gonna get those potatoes coated with that beautiful color of that paprika. Look at that on the color in there, nice. And we are gonna add these into our speedy and we're gonna cook them for uh, about 10 minutes on 350. We'll be right back. All right, welcome back. I've got my potatoes and uh, onions here. My, my ninja's warm. So I'm gonna just add these all in there like this. Move them around a little bit. And I will set this uh, to 350 for about 10 minutes on the bake. And hopefully that will, we'll, we'll check the potatoes. When the potatoes are just about ready, that's when we'll add in our kielbasa and our sauerkraut and cook it for about another 10 minutes. So here we go. We're gonna set this, watch this. Okay, it's 350. It's on the, uh, it's on the bake and roast mode. We're gonna set the, our timer for 10 minutes and hit start. And that's all there is to it. We'll be back. All right, welcome back. I'm going to cut both of my pieces of, uh, of kielbasa at one time. I'm just cutting them into pieces that are about three-eighths of an inch wide, so there'll be plenty of pieces uh, this size uh, for everybody to have. So uh, we'll get this cut up, and uh, in about seven minutes, our potatoes will be done. Done enough. We'll get our meat in there and our sauerkraut, and we'll show you how, just how quick and easy of a meal this is. We'll be back. All right, welcome back. I've got my kielbasa cut up and I've got my potatoes about halfway done. So I'm gonna can add in the last stage here, the kielbasa and one, uh, one large jar of Vlasic sauerkraut. And I'm gonna add it all in there. And the juice, doing this with one hand here, kind of, you can do it with one hand, see? Anybody can do it. If I can do it, anybody can do it. Okay, we're gonna take our, our tongs here and move this all around a little bit. Look at that, that is gonna be absolutely marvelous. So, we'll gonna let this all cook together. We're gonna put it, turn it back on, uh, bake for about another 10 minutes. We'll check it after 10 to see how the potatoes are. When the potatoes are done, everything will be ready. So, watch this. Close your lid, turn your machine on. Temperature to 350. It's on bake. You go with 10 minutes and all you do is hit start. It's that easy. We'll be back. All right, welcome back. Our timer went off and we have cooked this now for 20 minutes. Uh, and the potatoes feel like they're done. The meat, everything looks lovely and it smells heavenly. So we're gonna get this out, uh, get a plate set up and we'll be back for a taste test. Stay tuned. Hi, welcome back to Mama Four Boys. It's time for the taste test of the Polska kielbasa and the, uh, the potatoes and the onions and sauerkraut. I forgot to say that before. Uh, it's gonna be fantastic, I can't wait. Let's have a little potato and some sauerkraut. Mmm. The spices in this are just amazing out of this world. I love sauerkraut, see, and not everybody loves it, but 
I absolutely love it. And I love this uh, kielbasa too. Mmm. Wow. I'm glad I made a lot of it because I'm going to eat a lot of it. Let's have a little bit of uh, some bread and butter with it. Mmm. Now that I've tried it, I told you how good it is. I'm gonna, because I don't want to put this on everybody's because it's jalapeno. But I have this jalapeno uh, salt, pepper, and garlic that we got from the uh, Drunken Chef barbecue. Uh, we won it in a giveaway. And what giveaway did we win it? It was just doing our best with Shirley, right? Yeah. And uh, so we have this from the fellas at Drunken Chef barbecue. Uh, I already tasted it, it's incredible, but I haven't had it on any of my food yet, so uh, it's amazing. I'm, I'm gonna put this on mine because I love hot things. This it really isn't that hot, but boy, it's got a good flavor to it. And it doesn't just pour out of here. It's got nice holes in here where just the right amount comes out, just the right amount, not a ton, uh, which I like. So let's go ahead and give this a try. I'm excited to try this. This is a very good meal. Mm. Mm. It adds just a hint of heat, not a ton. And so I'm, I'm very, very pleased with the way this tastes. The next thing we're gonna do is cook it with it uh, in the food. We're gonna cook something with it in it. So uh, I'm really excited to eat the rest of my food. So. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe. Make this for your family. It's, you saw how fast I threw it together. Uh, very easy. Uh, basically a one-pot meal. And uh, tell your friends about us. Come back and watch all of our other videos. Please uh, go to Drunken Chef Barbecue and buy their spices. They are amazing. Uh, and uh, please check out uh, Just Doing Our Best with Shirley. Shirley at Just Doing Our Best. Thank you all. And... Uh, until the next time we see each other, have a great rest of your night, and God bless.